everyone. Thanks so much for stopping by. You guys are watching A Suburban Mom. So this is my closet. This side is mine and this side is my husband's. Um, so today we're just going to work on my side. I'm just going to declutter my things this moment and then maybe tomorrow or another next weekend we'll focus on my husband's. Um, but I really need to get through my stuff. Please like and subscribe and let's start to declutter my stuff. Uh, I'm wanting to do a more minimalistic um, theme to my closet. Kind of get rid of things I do not wear, I haven't touched in years. And be more realistic with my clothes. Anything that doesn't fit me, anything that's like a size smaller and I know it doesn't fit me, I'm just keeping it because I want to keep it. I'm not going to have any hard feelings. I'm just going to try to toss them and donate them. So... <laughs> Let's see how well I do this. I really love hats. I think I look cute in hats, but I'm going to donate that. Oh, I bought this purse on Shein. So if you guys ever heard of Shein, it's a really cheap, affordable website, um, online store, clothing store, and accessories as well. This is a really cute bag, but I never wear it. I don't. I don't wear it ever. Um, so I'm going to go donate it because realistically I don't ever use it. I just bought it because everybody on Instagram and YouTube was purchasing it. I think I'm going to keep this one. This is a Kate Spade. I think I'm just going to keep it because it's Kate Spade, you know. Um, my sister bought this. Oh, I need that. I need it down there. My sister bought this for, for me years ago. I love this little vest, this fur vest. Um, I don't know if it's still in style, but I think it's cute, so I'm going to keep it. I think I've only worn it a couple of times. This is not husband approved. My husband does not like this furry stuff, but I like it. Because some things are not husband approved, you know. Some things, the men don't like some of our fashion. Um, blazers, I'm a big fan of blazers, so I am keeping some of these blazers. As long as they fit me, I am keeping these blazers. So all my blazers, I'm going to leave on this thing because I've, I've always kept my blazers on um, in jackets and stuff. The first thing here, and then on the floor, not really throwing it. You have to be gentle with the clothes, you know. <laughs> This is from Eddie Bauer. It has little teepees on it. So cute. I love this. I love uh, shirts with patterns on it. So So I'm going to toss it and also it's really thick. So here's the thing about Shein. Um, they're really cute, but they're really, you know, they're cheap. So they're really thin material. It's almost like a forever, like a cheaper version of Forever 21. So if Forever 21 is a cheap store, this is even cheaper. Um, they're cute, but I don't wear it. John Lennon, you have to wear this, but come on. Come on, guys. I got to keep it. And this is so cute with a cardigan. I usually wear like my yellow cardigan and some like jeans, some booties, and then I'll look pretty cool. It's great for spring, so it's dress, and I'm gonna keep that back there. We'll have to have the black little dress, so this is great um, for interviews, funerals, evening events. Um, same with this. This is kind of like my interview dress if I ever have an interview or a meeting. Um, this is what I like to use white and house black market, so I always feel like you need to have some kind of sleeve, sleeve, a sleeve dress. Is that how you say it? Sleeve, am I saying that right? Dress in your wardrobe. Um, I'm like this on and it's so cute. Um, and then I'll worry about hangers later because I have this too. Great for summer. 
again, this is a cute fall dress. So my fall wardrobe stuff that's going to come, I'm going to put my fall dresses here and more of my winter, um, more of my summer, spring dresses in the back. And then I'll put my fall because I'm ready. <laughs> Guys love cleaning videos um anyway so I'll just kind of go over a couple of stuff I got these boots a couple years ago these are super cute right but I just don't I don't like them I don't like the way they fit on me I, I honestly the bottom of this hill right here look how little that is I literally have flipped uh, I have slipped like four times and I've worn the shoe four times meaning I have fallen quite a bit wearing these because I feel like this is so thin so that's just, I don't like the way this um, balances when I stand or when. And other things I'm probably going to get rid of are like high heels. Um, I don't wear heels anymore. I like wearing flats. I'm just not into them anymore. I, I will keep a few of them. The uh, stilettos, I'm not going to wear that anymore. They're a little thicker. I'm, I'm going to try to keep it. And if it's not worn out in the bottom of the heel, I'm going to keep it too. Because some of these, some of my shoes are worn out and I know you can take it into the shop to the shoe shop or whatnot but honestly I'm not gonna do it I'm not gonna have the time to go to the shop I want to just get rid of them either throw them in the trash if they need to be thrown or um donate them slip-ons I'm a sucker for slip-ons these are stain here's a pink one stain boots stay I love these booties um I'm a sucker for booties so those are gonna stay as well these are beautiful. I store all my seasonal clothes um, off season in a box. So I have a lot of my summer um, and spring season clothes in a box. So in the spring, when the summer comes around, I'm going to go back and I'll do another video and then start pulling out more of the spring stuff right now. Although it is January and it's 70 degrees in Texas, but you never know. It's supposed to get cold again. It's going to go back to freezing. Um, we're not over the winter yet. So it's just a fluke. I think it's just Texas weather. It's bipolar here. So I'm not going to bring out the summer clothes just yet. Be real here. For me, it takes a couple of days to go through everything. But anyway, so um, this is my first step to organizing. Um, I have my blazers, my thick sweaters here, uh, my um, thinner sweaters, and then I have my Henley shirts. I have my uh, polyester work shirts here. Then I have the plaid. Oops, see now I need to get that my black velvet hangers for that because it's falling apart um you know the button-up plaid shirts here and solid ones my t-shirts and then a couple of the dresses and then down there you will see i have um just a couple skirts and a couple of pants that i'm i will be wearing um and a couple of jeans that i will be wearing um this season um that is my minimalistic <laughs> wardrobe realistically this is what i will be wearing it is it's not like full of clothes. I'm trying to only put up what I'm going to wear. So wish me luck and let me know what you guys do um, to keep your closet, you know, clean and stress-free. And um, that way when you wake up and you're in a rush, you can just pick something up and it's gonna look good and you're gonna feel good. Um, so let me know what you guys do and how you guys keep up with your closet. Um, I would love to know tips and I don't know, let me know. Anyways, thanks so much for watching you guys. Um, I will continue cleaning up and you guys will see the next step after that, okay? I don't wanna show you guys all that, that's not fun. See, this is the end result. Look at all that. So I'm gonna go and donate that. You don't need to see all that. that um, that is it. I'm going to go clean and then um, next video, next weekend, whatever, when I have the time, I'll start decluttering all this other stuff. So take care. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Bye.